There is nothing like a ride down the Chattahoochee until you encounter the floating trash. Tonight, a clever effort to clean up the popular Atlanta area river and make it a lot more fun to shoot the hooch. CBS 46's Zach Summers is live along the hooch in Vinings, getting a firsthand look at how these trash traps are working. Zach. Well, it's likely you'll never see these traps as they are not on the actual river, but the group maintaining them say they are making all the difference in what they call a war on trash. Sitting on the water's edge of the Chattahoochee River. It's peaceful. Karen Baker's job to admire what she considers a beautiful slice of nature. The water is so clean and clear like that actually drew me in. But keeping this 435 mile river used for drinking water and recreation free of litter is no easy task. Here in Metro Atlanta, the biggest pollution threat is actually stormwater runoff. Jason Alseth is with Chattahoochee Riverkeeper, an environmental advocacy nonprofit that maintains a dozen trash traps placed in tributaries across Metro Atlanta that empty into the hooch. And we're finding that they're highly effective in screening out the trash out of these waterways. Allseth says when it rains, debris pours into creeks and storm drains, which end up in the tributaries. Instead of letting the garbage flow all the way downstream, the traps, which are mostly in urban areas, intercept the trash. It's a dirty job. Jordan Yu is a watershed protection specialist with the group. He cleans the traps by hand after each rainfall, pulling out mostly plastic and styrofoam. You have to be careful. Sometimes there'll be hazardous material that people litter that gets caught up in the trash traps. Last year alone, the devices, which are anchored by cables but can rise and fall with the water, kept some 2,400 pounds of trash from reaching the river. For there to be beautiful, clear water in a city as large as Atlanta, I think that those traps are incredibly necessary to keep this and preserve it the way it is. And the Chattahoochee Riverkeeper is testing out other trap prototypes and plan to add more in the future. The group, which still relies on volunteers to also pick up trash, they've collected some 2.4 million pounds of trash from the hooch since 1994. Live along the Chattahoochee River, you're Zach Summers, CBS 46 News. Thank you.